Hello, uh, let's further look at uh, this type of uh, logarithm which have the same base, right? Uh, same base. So if you have two, have four, then you may need to use the formula for the changing of base for the logarithm. But for this case, since the base already have, uh, have the same value, so you don't need to think about the formula for changing the base. So, but we still have question mark in our mind that how to solve this type of equation, right? So, okay, there maybe have several way. Uh, for me, I, I, I prefer that I bring uh, this one, this log base 2 to the other side. Alright? Okay, some students may do uh, 2. And you remember that here there is a multiply 1 here, right? And they try to make everything have uh, the equation, every term have log base 2. Right? Okay, uh, let's try with the one that uh, every every term here we convert to base 2. Okay, this is alright because this is already in base 2. But 2, how to convert a constant become base 2? Very simple. You have to remember that if you have 2, if you have 1, log 2 base 2 is also 1, right? Uh, why are I choosing log 2? Why are I not log 3, 3? Because I choose according to the question need. So the question need base 2, I convert to 2, right? If this is 4, I will 4, 4, alright? Uh, so this is a technique that you must remember so x square minus 6 right uh, x square minus 6 so now you have already have the same base now the, the please don't do thing is divide everything by log base 2 this is the most forbidden thing that you uh, that you shouldn't do so now uh, so you have log 2 2x minus 4 so uh, before that, you have to make sure in front of log there are no number. So you might bring it up, it uh, bring it up this thing. It become two to the power of two, which make four plus bit log base two x square minus six. Okay, another thing I tell you should not divide everything by log base two. You will be very happy because you get the value of x, but everything is wrong. Okay, uh, so you have to remember. <coughs> log 2 and here you see a plus right then I try to using the addition and subtraction law for, for uh, index so if you have log have the same base and 1 plus log x and y you can convert become mark product right product so for this case you see you, you have uh, 4 log same base 4 and x squared minus 6 so you can product okay you can multiply uh, 4 with x squared minus 6. Uh, so then you have log base 2, 2x two minus 4. Uh, now it's a time for you to do comparison because this have a log base 2, log base 2. So I can directly say that these two are exactly the same. So now I can see that it's forming a quadratic equation, right? 4x squared minus 24. So you have 4x to the power of 2 uh, minus with 2x, uh, minus with 2x, uh, negative 24, negative 24 plus 4. You have negative 20, right? Which give you 0. Double check, 4x squared minus 2x, negative 24 plus 4, you have negative 20. Everything divided by 2, so you have 2x to the power of 2 minus x minus 10 equals to Zero. Then you have reached a quadratic. Can you see that? From a logarithm equation, you have reached a quadratic. Okay, now it's time for you to uh, get the roots for, for this quadratic. So, then you have bracket. You have 2x, x. The best will be uh, 5 and 2, right? Because 5, 2, you have 10. The negative is here. Negative means either one is positive, either one is negative. So I will put negative in front of 5 here because negative 5, this one you will get 4. So you will put positive. Negative, positive, 5, 2, 10. So negative 5 plus 4. So you have negative 1. So now you can know that negative, uh, 2x plus 5 minus 5 equals 0 and x plus 2 equals to 0. Then you have two solution. 5 over 2, x equals to negative 2, right? Ah, remember this, for this type of case where the base are the same and you tend to compare, <coughs> you have to remember that 
these two solutions, one of the solution may not be the solution for the equation here. So, so let's look at x equals to 5. Okay, let's look it by, by, by observing, okay? 5 over 2. Is 5 over 2 okay to be the, the solution for both these? So, okay, uh, let's do checking. Let's do checking. All right, let's do checking. Let's say you have a uh, left-hand side. Left-hand side to be uh, 5 over 2. So the left-hand side will be log 2x minus 4 to the base 2. So it means you will have log 2, 2 multiply 5 over 2, uh, minus 4, right? Minus 4, which bring uh, 2, 2, and you have log 2, 5 minus 4, you have log 1. You know that log 1 to do any type of base, as long as it's log 1, the value is 1, it will be 0, right? Uh, means the left-hand side will give you 0 for 5 over 2. Okay, let's look at the, the right-hand side. Okay, right-hand side for 5 over 2. Okay, you may not happy what you are doing now. Okay, you have to do checking. But in reality, you need to explain. You need to reason out why this is a solution or why this is not a solution. Alright, uh, your attitude to doing this logarithm must correct. Okay, uh, so log base 2, uh, okay, you have 2, right? Sorry, you have 2 plus log base 2, x square. Alright, x square. So it means this is a 5 over 2 square, right? 5 over 2 square minus with 6. So you have 2 plus log 2, which uh, you will get... Uh, 5 over 2, 25 over 4, 25 over 4, am I correct? 25, uh, yeah, 25 over 4, minus with 6, minus with 6, which you have 1 over 4, uh, you have 1 over 4, uh, you, you, you will see that whether this will reach 0 or not, alright, I'm not sure, so uh, we have to try until the end, so log, 4 base 2 4 4 is 2 to the power of negative 2 uh, seems like we have hope that this is the solution so 2 you can bring down the negative 2 and and don't forget log 2 base 2 will be 1 so 2 minus 2 you have 0 yes the left hand side is the same as the right hand side uh, so you are very hardworking and you already know that this will be your Solution. Alright, so now I'm going to do for the uh, x equals to negative 2. Is x equals to negative 2 acceptable? <coughs> so let's see. Okay, you can try first. Alright, so let's see. Eh? So for negative 2, you can try that log 2, 2, negative 2, minus 4. You see, you already fail. x negative 2 already fail on the left hand side because why? Can you see the reason or not? Uh, you have negative 8. It's not defined, right? This is not defined. So you are not going to check for the right hand side anymore. Because this is causing this equation to be not defined. So this, of course, is not the solution for this equation. So now you have confirmed that your, <coughs> your solution for this case is only 1, which is x equals to 5 over 2, right? Uh, remember that. So hope you can understand this and you can try uh, your, your uh, question inside tutorial.